Good morning, everyone. It's 1040 in the morning, and we are ready to hit the road in our CFI semi and trailer. We're in the Kenworth T680, I believe it is. If you do enjoy this content and you want to see more of it, you got to let me know in the comments down below. And, uh, well, let's get right on into it. We are in, well, about 60 miles south of Redding, California right now. And uh, we are headed to pick up some dry milk to take on over to Truckee. Let's go ahead and get on out of here. It's going to be a nice, calm video today. For those of you who don't know, the red CFI semi here is inspired by, well, I mean, CFI, the actual trucking company, I suppose. But my inspiration for doing this run today is Riding with Dave, a YouTube channel uh, that I watch quite a lot of personally. He's very entertaining. He does a lot of, uh, he's a trucker in real life, drives for CFI. Go straight. So if that's something that interests you, then maybe you should definitely check it out. Boy, I have some touchy brakes on this truck. I think I need to turn those down. <laughs> there's uh, there's no way that little of input should stop this truck like that. We are making a lot of changes in 2022. A lot of changes. And one of those is bringing different types of games consistently. I have dabbled with it here and there in the past, and I'm ready to just go full force. The main content will still be... God, that yellow. We probably could have made it. We'll still be Farming Simulator, but we'll have some ATS and uh, other games thrown in the mix as well. Pray night, look out, cows! Oh, heck yeah, Have brother. You. By the way, if at any point in time I'm looking over at something and you guys don't see it, it's because I didn't look far enough. I do apologize. I'll try to remember to do that. I'm playing on an ultra wide, so I see a whole lot more on my sides than you guys see. Pull up here, turn on the four ways, talk to the farm manager or whatever. And see what we're picking up today, shall we? All right, we got our load dry milk is what we're going to be picking up. And they said it would be just back around to the right over there where we need to back in. So I think we're going to pull all the way down, use that little spot right over there to pull forward. And it should give us a nice uh, straight. I'm hoping it'll be a straight back. Never. I love that little trailer. Look at that little baby. Little baby trailer thing kind of cute all right it's been a couple hours they've got us loaded up live load is complete so we're going to go ahead and turn on the electric let's try and fire up the truck don't kill it there we i knew it i knew it was gonna do it man let's try it again here there we go perfect let's go ahead and get our brakes put off here pull that window up 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 there we go Push button. It's a little difficult sometimes. Time to hit the road. 1.14 p.m. We've got a 200 mile journey ahead of us here today, which means we should take about four hours, four and a half hours to get there. It's gonna put us there at, let's call it 5, 5.30, give or take. After 100 yards, turn left. You got it. Sure thing, GPS lady. We don't actually have a stop sign because it's a driveway, but, you know, it's common courtesy to stop. Obviously, I'm not the most courteous person because I rolled right through there. There was a semi coming, so, you know, as slow as we are to pull out, right. he had to slow down. I'm kind of being a, a jerk, but he had a stop sign up here anyway, so it doesn't matter. Nice four-way stop out here in the middle of nowhere. Thank God it's a four-way because... For a second, I saw that truck coming right there and had a mini heart attack. I was like, uh-oh. Anybody who lives uh, up north in the cold climate, how you been enjoying the winter so far? Are you someone who actually likes the snow? I'm not personally. It is not for me. I've been doing a lot, a lot of work to California, and uh, I'm really loving the state now. You know, this was this first state that they did back in 2016 when they released the game. And... Uh, you can tell that they've gotten significantly better at building states since then. So I'm glad that they have been coming back and, and doing some reworks on California. I think we're on phase two now, will be released soon. And uh, I know that they hope to do at least a phase three, I believe. So very, very excited. Okay, car. What are you gonna do in my inside? You're gonna eventually get past me? You're gonna hang out right there? I don't like having cars there, because what if the truck up there slams the brakes? Watch this, watch this, it's going to happen. The bus pulled up forward, the truck's going to have to hit its brakes, I'm going to have to hit my brakes because this car's going... This car's going slower than me? 
Y'all realize, like, your speed limit is, what, 70? And then my speed limit is 55. Like, I get there's a semi in front of you, but, bro, just pull out. Like I was saying, California is a state that deserved to be redone because it is quite beautiful, and I'm glad that they're doing it. I know we have Texas and Montana coming up real soon. Texas first, and then Montana next, I believe. Very, very very excited for that can't wait to get into texas it's gonna be a huge state such a diverse landscape that state will have so i'm really curious to see how they manage texas and then we're into the region that most people won't care about but i am so excited for and that is the midwest i'm guessing i don't know for sure but it would make sense if we got montana and texas We've done all of the West. We've now moved on to the Midwest section, like North Dakota, South Dakota, Nebraska, Kansas. You know, even, I don't I don't think Oklahoma really counts, but we're gonna count it. Oklahoma, you know, and so on. We're, you know, that's kind of the next stretch that I imagine that they'll be doing. And I'm very excited for that because that is the stretch that I've grown up in my entire life. As most of you know, I am from the great state. Can I get around this guy, please? The great state of Iowa. Whole lot of corn, whole lot of soybeans, whole lot of chickens, whole lot of pigs. Uh, the number one producer of corn, soybeans, chickens, pigs. And uh, I don't know what else. Wind energy? No, we're number like two in wind, er wind energy, actually. I think Texas beats us. But you get the idea. I am excited for the Midwest, as I'm sure a lot of you are as well. What are all these little trees out here? They've got, uh, are these olive trees growing or? We're up here in Northern Cali, which is a very well-producing agriculture area. Uh, California has actually got a huge, huge agriculture business or industry, I should say, up here in Northern California. And I, I almost wonder what some of these these crops are specifically the ones off on our left over there if anybody would happen to know that would be fantastic are they some sort of fruit tree um they don't look like grapes i know grapevines can grow out here in northern cali uh pretty well if i'm not mistaken i am all the way over here in this left hand lane and i really shouldn't be also we've got an intersection up here or like you know what i'm trying to call it wow guy Woo! yep your brakes freaking work my guy you didn't have to go down to 30 just to make this turn you know they design them so you don't have to slow down that much like yeah you gotta slow down especially if it says you know suggested speed limit particularly up here on the loop but right back there dude no, that's not how this works. This is the area where you slow down, my guy. You need to go back to school. Oh, 25 on here? We are going at it a little fast. We're about five miles over. Need to get it back down. I'm hoping I can just roll through and the engine brake will keep slowing me down here. And so far it is. Now we're speeding up a little bit. I'm going to turn that engine brake up. There you go. Keep her slow. Beautiful. Left. We managed it about 27 the whole way, so we're a little fast on it. Come on. You gotta be kidding me with this. Enough of your road. Oh my God, look at those. Did you see the mountains in the distance though? That was absolutely gorgeous, my God. But now I'm kind of upset that we just got sent on a detour loop here. My GPS is going to be confused. Right. It's going to be like, I don't understand anymore. All right. What we're going to have to do... I gotta, I don't want to head west to San Francisco. That is the complete opposite direction that I need to go. I need to get somewhere I can pull off and reroute. We're doing a Yui. Long story short. A complicated Yui, but it, it's a Yui. This is a park low up here. Heck yeah. Pepsi is up here. Oh, is this the same guy that slammed on his, on his brakes earlier? Probably. Surprised you don't work for that guy right up there driving away. Swift up here. Eastbound on the 80. 80. Oh. Oh, this is 80. Hey, nice. I like it. I like it. 80 is a big old highway. All right. Interstate. Whatever you want to call it. Interstates are a highway. Sort of. Dude, this looks so good. I really love this intersection. They did a fantastic... 
They just get better and better every single time they work on these things, man. We're finally headed in the direction of the mountains that I saw that were pretty. That was a bit of a detour, wasn't it? It's, oh my God, it's almost 6 p.m. That was a major detour. There's that accident still not cleared up. I, I'm, I'm, I'm swaying off the road because I'm out here gawking at the, the scenery. I'm just like, ooh, look at that. That's pretty neat. I love mountains so much. They're just so photogenic, dude. There's just something about them that you look out and it's just beautiful. Do you live where there's mountains? If so, I'm jealous of you. I don't know why our truck is gonna make it up these though. I'm gonna be completely honest with you. We having some problems. My truck, uh, well, she ain't got much power. We're currently crawling up at 25 miles per hour. We haven't overheated yet. <laughs> so we're doing okay there. Although it is running a bit hot. Oh, we made it to the tippy tippy top. Hopefully. That is all the climbing we're gonna... There's a helicopter somewhere. Y'all hear that? Our customers expect the delivery very soon. Make sure you arrive on time. Sure thing, dispatch. I'm doing what I can, man. We've still got half an hour till we get there. What do you want from me? It is 7 p.m. We are running so behind. I thought we'd be there at like five or six. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Come on, keep slowing it down. A bit of a hill. We're gonna use that to our advantage. Actually, we didn't have to slow down this much because we're on an upward ramp. It's going to slow us down a lot right here. Watch. I'm going to let off that gas. We're going to slow down. There's 25 right there. There's like 15. Yeah, we could have slowed that down even better yet. Good lord, car. You uh, you coming out of nowhere. That was a blind turn, my guy. Nobody there. Nobody there. Nobody there again. We're good. Make the turn. Driving to town. And, uh, we're here. Oh, dear God. This is not going to be one of them drops, is it? Oh, you suckers. We're going to have to back it around the corner. You've got to be hitting me right now. We have to back this trunk and trailer around the building without hitting anyone's cars up here. Um, without hitting any fence, I'm gonna probably be silent for a bit of this here. Because it's gonna take a lot of focus. But I'll let you guys watch the process here. You guys can't quite see the trailer when I do that. I need to look farther over, don't I? There we go. Just let it keep rolling back. Looking good, looking good. I'm trying to watch the driver's side. We got a lot of room there. So we should be all right. I'm gonna keep rolling it back at this angle here. Looking good. Okay. Straight, 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 straight. There you go. Go ahead and fish it just a little bit. Boom. Let's take it, pull that brake, step out, check our work. And it's in the spot at the very least. So there you go, guys. That's going to be it for this trip. Hope you all enjoyed. Till next time, see you all later. Peace. So quit chasing all the time.